Well, I suppose we should get working on getting our way back to, you know, our hometown, or at least the Adventurer Guild part. Okay, well, you guys know. Yeah, I know you can stomp them down. However, when they die, you'll be hurt as well. Please be careful. Yeah, I'll try. Yeah, yeah, it will. And yeah, killing them would be a good idea. Let's see. Yeah, of course we should tread carefully. Though I bet we should probably abuse that healing point when we get to it. Gosh darn it, do we have to get dragged into a fight like this? Okay, let's just try and take out the boar first. Um, there we go. Have you two team up on that, guard. And probably just, you know, let that thing throw an attack, why not? After all, it's not like it's gonna hurt me that bad. Okay, let's let the dragon join the fight and see what we're dealing with here. A serpentine, eh? Well, it's probably not very powerful, but it doesn't really need to be to be annoying for us at the moment. I mean, let's face it. We're not a very powerful force yet. Oh, it blinded us, but it only did small amounts of damage. Okay. Well, since we're blind, might as well just throw it down, I guess. Gosh darn it. It's, it's just gonna keep inflicting the status, ain't it? Damn, annoying son of a gun. Okay, we'll do that, and then we'll try an Oblivion Song it again. Gosh darn it. I never seem to stick that. I mean, to a certain extent, it makes sense. I mean, dragons are usually immune to most, uh... Well, not immune, but highly resistant to most status effects. And without a fighter on our party with an axe to lower that resistance, it's gonna be hard to stick any status effects, even at, like, max level. But yeah, like I said, I, I, we want to get over to the, um, heal point. Because if I can get there, I can abuse it for the rest of the fights, basically. Okay, let's just take you out, offer some healing over to Pris, obviously. At least we're fast in this thing, so we can, uh, keep it on the defensive a bit there. Though I wish it would stop pressing. And I guess we got a bit lucky there, since it didn't kill anyone while I was, uh, pressing the wrong t distracted over there, but... Oh, come on, another press? Damn it. I'm gonna use up basically all my magic in that first fight. Ugh. That sucks. And I gotta ignore this bloom, too. In some places, I can't avoid the damage. Like, I just gotta take it. Okay. Got it. Oh, this thing's so big, I don't know if we're gonna see anyone else jump in. Though I admit, I'm not sure we'll be able to win this fight. Please get off here. Oh, that's right, we ambushed it, so we should be able to get that, no problem. Um, let's see. I need people to EX attack this thing, because I need this thing push to the brink really damn fast. Like, I ain't got time to be nice. We're gonna be coming in coming out, I guess, quite a bit here. But, you know, if that's what I gotta do, it's what I gotta do. I will do what is necessary, even if it is cowardly. And how'd that thing get the jump on me? But I wish I was putting these into actual EX skills. Instead of, you know, just a basic attack here. Okay. Come on, just finish it off. Ow. 
Yep, all out of MP. Or, uh, and, and I guess in this case. And you know, like I thought, those dragons are too big that no one else can even join in on the fight. Of course, now I gotta get out of here without, you know, having anyone drop dead. A lot easier said than done with Poppy. Really, uh, have her use up another two, maybe? I mean, I might have some healing potions on hand. I can hope. Um. Item. Oh, that's way too powerful for this. Um, yeah, we'll use up another nut. I don't have a ton of them, though, so I can't afford to waste all of them on her. Now we're gonna have to run all the way back to town. Like I said, once we have access to the um, healing spring, it'll be a lot more convenient. Come on, need to get out of here. Oh, we got jumped? Crap. Well, it didn't hit anyone that was in serious condition. Okay. I'm okay with it then. Not that the nuts are gonna hurt a lot anyway. Who knows, maybe we can bust a nut and have some fun. Oh, no, no nuts for us. Darn. I guess we didn't bust them hard enough. You gotta bust those nuts real hard to get, the, get access to the inner nut, right? The, the nut that can heal you with its inner goodness. Come on, just, just go down, will you? Give up, slime. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna look forward to having access to mana recovery. It'll be really damn helpful. Uh, don't wish me good night. I really don't want to take a nap right now. I'm being forced to. No, I really don't want to do that bit. After all, we haven't done anything really worth saving. Like, who? we took down two dragons that weren't even very good. Ugh. I was hoping that'd be a bit more useful. To be honest, but whatever. I'll save that, because I'm going to need it. For another mission. Okay, so we have a Silk Whip. Well... Probably should put on Poppy, because, you know, that's who we're building up to be a physical attacker right now. I forgot we had that. Yep, quite the boost. Sally, I don't think she has enough points to really work anything useful in here. Yeah, like punishment. I need Terrorize and Dominance level 3. Ugh. We'll get there eventually, though. The real trick will be keeping her alive on low health, because we're going to have to use revive items if we go that route. Ugh. It's going to be a pain. But sometimes, you know, that's just... It's just the best way to play a game, right? When it's that it's most agonizing. <laughs> I mean, why, why not see how far we can get when we're, you know, pushing ourselves into a serious challenge? I mean, no one would think this is a good idea. I mean, the party composition's horrible. Like, do we have enough adaptability to make it maybe potentially work? Maybe. But that's a big freaking maybe. Ooh, nice whipping action there. Okay, let's uh, head on back into the forest, and hopefully the dragons haven't respawned. I don't think they will, but, you know, I don't usually rest that in before I finish off dragons in an area. I don't usually need to. I mean, this is an odd situation for me to be in. Come on, just finish off the bees. Oh, that wasn't bad experience gain. Thank you, bees. Though, they're probably hornets, right? Okay, the dragons didn't come back, so we didn't rest enough for them to respawn. Oh, crap, I was running way too low there. That was bad. Um, let's see... Um, Oblivion Song, I guess. A risky option, but hopefully it works. 
Ow. Oh, great. Lord, my defenses. I don't even have a counter for that right now. Ugh. Gosh darn it. <laughs> that just sucks. Oh, crap. We're gonna wake that one up. Oh, we just straight up murdered it. Before we got the heal off. Shoot, that's not really what I wanted to do. I mean, I can make it work. Don't get me wrong, it just sucks, because that wasn't what I wanted to do. Darn it, wasn't fast enough. Okay. Well, since we're not going to have heed words in play just yet... And Oblivion Song, I guess. I'll take a crack at it. Yep, still not working. Really? You had to blind me. Okay, get her cured before she gets, you know, knocked out, right? Because I know the press is coming. Okay. Thank you. Okay, one enhanced attack, why not? Hopefully that's in time. No, it wasn't. Crap. At least it didn't hit her, I guess. I need to heal you now. Man, that thing's being a pain in my butt. It's making me dump all my SP here. Just die, damn you. Like, seriously. I mean, I'll take it. But less than thrilled. Okay, we want to try and sneak past this thing, I think. Okay, can I, like, get out of here real quick? Okay, let's just take these two down. And then try and make our way over to the water. Because if we activate the water, we, we'll be good. Um, no, not you. After all, I can now use the water for a healing supply boost and then go hunt the other dragons. I'll end up burning through a lot of magic this way, but it's fine. Because I got plenty of mana recovery now, because it's free. And no, I really don't care to step on that with those things around, because they might use, like, sleep or something else and mess us up. Might as well turn to face it so we get back slammed. That'd be real bad. You know what? Screw it. Just, just stab at it. It's the only thing I have that's worth doing. I can't make that any more effective than it was. Oh, did it miss it for a change? That's cool. It makes me miss all the time. It's only fair that it misses sometimes too, right? Okay, let's get the cure off. Thank you. <sighs> cure the same target again, why not? And got pressed again. Gosh darn it. That consistent need to press me is starting to annoy the crap out of me, man. Go press on somebody else, you overgrown lizard. Ugh, so close to level 17. So close, yet so very far. Oh, you're not going to be joining in. It's like I know. There's, there's no way. These things are way too big for you to pull that off. Like, if they were a smaller breed, that'd be more of a threat, but not with this one. Like, try again another day, right? 
Oh, come on. Seriously, what did Pris do to piss you off? Oh, crap. That's gonna be a miss. And I don't have any revive items. So I'm gonna have to fight down with just three now. Okay. Let's power up. I mean, we're gonna have to leave now. I already know that much. So let's just enhance these attacks. Well, they're gonna get ahead on the levels, I suppose, but, you know, it is what it is. And it's not by a ton, so it'll work out alright, I suppose. But yeah, not even this is gonna revive a character. Like, I'm gonna have to leave. Because nothing revives against death. How irritating. I didn't buy any convenient teleporters either, so I'm guessing we're gonna get jumped by something on the way out. Can we win with just three people, though? That is the question. Okay, that was a bit spread, but yeah, it looks like they're weak enough we can pull this off. Now to head back to town and pay out of our no through our nose to get a revive going. Because that hospital charges you like an arm and a leg for these revivals. Come on. I, I guess I should have heeded their advice a bit more carefully about the whole, you know, avoid dying thing, right? Okay. I can only hope the dragons inside the cave are, uh... Not as challenging, because it might be a sign that, you know, this run's gonna come to a screeching halt really early on, unless we do, uh... An insane amount of grinding. And I only have so much patience, you know? But we'll see. Level 17, eh? Well... That will let me put a point or two towards dominance, but... I need, you know, several more points to pull off getting, you know, that one whip skill, which I really want. Okay. Revive. Oh, 32, because double the level, yeah. Kind of annoying. Okay, we'll just rest the night for now. No, no, no. I guess we can go check out the, um... Store and see if maybe we can buy some better stuff. But I don't think that's going to be an option for us. Like, there aren't any hints that this stuff's going to open up better gear. Hunting charm. Okay, we did get something new. Cool. Get rid of that stuff. Don't really need a whip. Oh, I do have one of these. Okay. Hunting charm. Improves speed by three. Well, now. But I have to come with the cost of attack and defense in POW. I don't know if that's a good trade off. Well, you gotta think carefully about that stuff where you do it, after all. Um, let's see. Any other ice worth grabbing it here, baby? Oh, get more of them, huh? Well, we could buy another exporter. Cuts and scrapes, recovers 30 life, huh? Okay, we'll buy a couple of those to uh, make things a bit easier on the healer. And we really don't need more than one of those, just so we know we remember to use it next time. Well, that'll do for this episode. Next time, we'll hopefully finish off the remaining dragons, at least in that forest area. Until then, see ya.